Hi, my name is Jen Myers. I'm a volunteer for the Friends of the Attleboro Animal Shelter. And I'm here today to introduce you to some of the animals that we have up for adoption and to tell you a little bit about the shelter here in Attleboro. The first animal that we're gonna talk about today is our cat, Tiggy. She's one of our senior cats. She is 11 years old. She's a little overweight. We have her on a special diet right now to try and get her to lose weight, but she would do much better if she were in a home where she'd have a lot more room to exercise. Um, because she's a little older, she has a little crabby little meow when she meows. She sounds a little grumpy old lady, but she is a very friendly cat and she is playful. She just had her bark is worse than her bite, we say. She doesn't bite. So Tiggy is a wonderful girl. Huh, girl, yeah. She likes to be head scratched. She'll come up. She loves her food, but as we said, she's on a diet. She gets small amounts of diet food every day. She'd be a great companion for someone who is not especially active in a quieter household, but someone that would be able to, you know, play with her with a laser light or with a feather toy so that Tiggy can get some exercise. Hi, Tiggy. Tiggy is okay with other cats as long as they're also very calm. So I wouldn't suggest putting her in a home with a kitten or with a dog. If it was another older cat, she would probably be okay as long as you gave them a while to really get to know each other. Um, gave them a lot of time to introduce themselves to one another. One of the great things about adopting an older cat is they're sort of settled into their personality. You know what you're going to get. Also, like I said, if you don't want an active cat, older cats are usually a little bit more sedate. They don't have that kitten energy. So they're not running around all the time. You don't have to worry about them really destroying things as much because they're bored. Um, so you have more sort of cuddle time usually. They're a little bit more independent. So it's a lot better for people who are themselves a little bit more independent. Want a cat that will come and just sit with them, maybe watch while you're watching TV, that they can do a little bit of play time with. And you know what you're gonna get, whereas a kitten, you know, they, their personalities just sort of grow on up as they do. You're not sure if you're gonna get a kitten that likes to cuddle or a kitten that likes to play. So that's one of the big advantages of having a already senior cat. Also, it's already fixed. She's already, you know, in her litter box trained. Um, all the animals here that we had dropped out have been spayed, neutered, are up to date on all their shots, and we have started microchipping the cats as well. So all the cats, senior cats, which is any cat um, above six years old, and like I said, Tiggy is eight years old. All of those cats are $110, and that includes the spay or neuter, the all up to date with shots, and the uh, microchipping. If anyone's interested in Tiggy or any of our other cats or dogs, you can contact FAST at www.fastpets.org or www.facebook.com at FAST Attleboro Pets. Hi, my name is Cynthia Guy and I live in Mansfield and I've heard a lot of really great things about this Attleboro shelter so I thought I'd definitely give it a shot. And I came down here and I, I met some fantastic people and even better animals that need homes. I'm very happy that I came down here. This is my little friend, Pogi. Uh, she's a doll. She's a Jack Russell Terrier. She's four years old and she's very sweet. Love at first sight. She's just uh, somebody I want to bring home. Honestly, I, I can't imagine any more dedicated people. Uh, you know, these people are 100% 200% animal people, and uh, I think uh, the animals are very lucky to have everybody here. I can't even imagine going up any other place than the shelter. You know, these animals are really good animals. They need homes, and uh, this particular shelter is, <laughs> I think, one of the best places I've definitely looked for an animal.